All right, folks, we're back for Schmunday with Sam. So finally, a moment of reprieve from last week's craziness or hecticness with the auction stuff and wrapping up the anniversary event as well. So you have to grind for the credits to get the advantage of the discounts for equipments and consumables that we didn't have for like eight months or something. The last equipment sale was practically holiday ops. We should have gotten one for April's server anniversary, but no, we didn't get one. So I had to wait a while, but I had to refit all my high tier tank destroyers from using binoculars to using coated optics or vents. And that took a while. That took a lot of credits, but eh, eh, OCD <laughs> had to manage all my like 400 vehicles properly. Oh God. But funny enough, the auction came out of nowhere. I didn't see it coming. Nobody saw it coming. And then it sucked. <laughs> I mean, the first lot, the object 268 version number five was surprising. So it is rare, technically. And it's for 20 million credits, which is surprising because back in February, I think, for the under the hammer, under the auction hammer thingy, my jig, that vehicle gone for about 400,000 free XP, so quite a lot, but now it's only for 20 million credits. It's less than the Fosh 155 or the FE 215B183 in terms of credit cost. Those cost about 25 million, but well, then again it was auctioned, but still, I don't think people will spend that much on the 268, but whatever. It was alright, but then we got the Paragon IS-3A for free XP, 100,000 free XP, baseline, eh, it was close, so you could have gotten it for like 100,000 free XP on the Asian server or the North America server, you could have gotten it for about 120,000 free XP or so, so it wasn't, it wasn't that high expensively of a premium, I guess, so not bad. But then we got the Asian servers leak of the WZ120 GFT and the Gonzalo and we thought ooh it's for free XP turns out it's for freaking gold <laughs> about 15,000 gold for the WZ120 GFT and about 10,000 gold starting bid for the Gonzalo I was like no not worth it's, it's practically nothing. No. It's not it's not nothing. It's not not even worth your time. Don't even think about it. <laughs> also, the fiasco with the WZ is that it still doesn't have the bond making advantage. Some people are saying that it doesn't have the credit making advantage as well. So I wonder how long Wargaming is going to take to micropatch the fix in before people get pissed off. They're already pissed off. <laughs> And the Gonzalo for baseline of a tier A premium worth of gold. No, that vehicle is not that worth that much. I mean, 7,000 gold during advent calendar, maybe? I don't know, but nah, not 10,000 gold starting bid for a Gonzalo. No, not even close. No oh, thanks. Alright, <laughs> right, enough about the stupid auction. It's. Also, you had to pay gold for the Warhammer stuff. I thought it was for like a few million of credits, like three million credits for the two crew and some decal. That sounds nice. It's fair, right? Nope. It's for 3,000 gold. <laughs> also, the skin for the T95 is five million or not even five million. It's about five million starting bid for a skin. That's a tier nine. And a half! A little bit more! Jesus! <laughs> no! It's close to a price of a tier 10 for a skin. That's like 5 out of 10. It's alright, it's not that cool looking. It doesn't show off the menacingness of the Doom Turtle. But 5 million credit is definitely not worth. Alright, enough about the auction. Enough about the anniversary stuff. So no more free premium days. 
which means no more gold spam with just any tank. I see a lot more of those during the anniversary stuff and the holiday ops. Free premium days means more gold spam. Great. So no more of that. We're finishing with consumable discounts. We're finishing with equipment discounts and all the good stuff. So take a rest. Take a break. Be ready for season 9 of Battle Pass. The last season. And judging from the free camouflage. The 2D camouflage. There's not going to be a theme. So there's no... Warhammer stuff or anime stuff, unfortunately. So there's no theme. It's just a regular battle pass stuff with just regular theme, I guess. So, oof. There's no leaks of the skins yet. So I don't know what the hell the skin looks like, unfortunate. But 1.18 will be coming out next week. So be ready uh, for the Italian tank destroyers and the map improvements and the new map and the matchmaker stuff. All the good stuff. That's great. Also, there's a micro patch that buffed the penetration of the Minotaur, the Minotauro at tier 10, the Italian tank destroyer. They buffed the base AP shell pin from 255 to 265, which is good. Nerfed the gold shell pin and nerfed the top speed from 36 to 30. So, a little bit more of a rebalancing, not really, but I still think the credit maker is the tier 7. And. The last stuff on the list is the HD pictures for the CS52C version came out. And it's practically a CS63's turret at tier 10 mounting onto the LIS, the premium tier 8. And that's basically it. It has crappy penetration, crappy alpha, DPM and stuff, you already know. So it's the tier 10's turret on a tier 8 premium, practically. And that's it. Well, there you go, folks. A quick video for Schmundays, because there's nothing to really talk about. Not really. Everybody's busy with auction stuff, and everybody got caught up on the auction stuff, and got super disappointed. <laughs> auction was like a... I say... 4 out of 10, maybe 3 out of 10. I mean, the IS-3A for that much free xp is decent it's not bad but the rest of the offerings piss people off <laughs> like the wz uh, 120 gft like the gonzalo it's not worth gold you have to give uh, give us free xp or credits or something i don't know i mean if the gonzalo was up for like six million free x uh six million not free xp six million credits yeah maybe consider that or the WZ120 GFT is up for like 15 million credits. Mm, considerable, right? I could consider getting it for collector's edition or collecting the tanks, but yeah, gold is not. No. <laughs> well, there you go, folks. Uh, take a break, rest. It's It's been a while. The grind, the auction stuff, take a break. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.